about Brooke? What are you doing? Violet has your toy. Annabelle. The puppy has your toy. Violet has your toy. Look, Annabelle. Look it. I know. Here you go, Lila. Is that your toy? Oh, you're getting puppy kisses. <laughs> Where are you going? Straight out the door. Excuse me. Do you have anything to say about stealing the puppy toy? Oh yeah, give her more kisses, Lila. Is that your toy? Are you really gonna try to take her toy again? Is that a ball? Is that your ball? Yeah, that's your ball. Hello everybody and welcome back to another video with the baby and I with me and the baby. Should I know this by now? I feel like I should know this proper grammar and I just don't. Um I couldn't find my camera this morning, so I didn't bring it with me, but I went to ROTC orientation, which was basically just a bunch of information about what could possibly happen the next four years of school regarding ROTC. So, that was fun. It was a lot of good information, so I'm really happy that I went. Um, got all my paperwork turned in that I needed to, and now it's just a waiting game to see if I will actually be able to contract because of my situation, there is a good chance that I won't be able to, in which case, me doing ROTC or the ROTC classes isn't really doing much for me at all. So, that's kind of where we are right now. And it's fine. I'll get something out of it, no matter what. I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope. Because I don't want to waste all this time, because if I didn't do ROTC and, um, so, if I do even just this year of ROTC and then realize that I can't contract, I'm still probably going to finish school in four years instead of three. Whereas if um, I wouldn't do ROTC at all, then I would probably get done in three years, no matter what. But I'm kind of taking a chance on this, just hoping, 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 hoping for the best. So, that is kind of why I've been 
working out a lot, I've been running, I've been doing sit-ups, I've been doing push-ups, basically anything to help me pass my PT test, and I think that will kind of give me a leg up in this whole dealio, but who knows? I don't know what's going to happen, I don't know how much leeway they have on um, giving people waivers, I don't know if it's more of a selfish thing, or like oh yeah, we need you, so we'll give you a waiver because you're committed, or if it's more like, um, like, no, you need to do what's best in our eyes for your child, so, I don't know, we will see, I'm frustrated right now, I'm stressed out right now, I don't want to waste a year of my life um, if I'm not going to get anything out of it. So if I can go through with ROTC and I can go through the whole four years, then it's worth it. If I can only do it one year, then I'm basically wasting a whole year because I'm taking three extra credits, which are taking three other classes off my schedule. <sighs> and yeah, I don't know if that all makes sense, but that was my rant for today. And now we can go. So I've been freaking out about like ROTC classes because I'm just not used to having them <laughs> on my schedule and that was kind of like a big change in my schedule like I was so nervous about them that I kind of forgot that I also have other classes on Monday so I'm like <laughs> starting to get my stuff ready for those classes like get my backpack <laughs> all ready and everything but I'm like oh oh crap I have more than just that I just took a nice little nap <laughs> You can hear Annabelle on the monitor. She just woke up. She is making all her cute little noises. And I'm going to go get her because I've got to soak up all these moments I can with her before the craziness begins. Because craziness is starting on Monday. Actually, the craziness has already started in my head because I'm going slightly insane. I'm a little stressed out, overwhelmed, whatever else. <laughs> But, I don't want to leave her at all, but I want to be a better version of myself for her. So, it takes a little sacrificing now to be able to do things that I want to be able to do for her later in life. So, it's a compromise, I guess. And it's hard, <laughs> but we'll get there. It'll be fine. It'll be good. She gets to spend time with her grandma, who she absolutely loves, and my gr my grandma, no, my mom absolutely loves her, loves spending time with her, so I'm so grateful that she is willing to do that for me and for Annabelle, but we're going to go get her. Hi, baby. Did you wake up from your nap? Yes, you did. Yes. Some nice air in here before it's too cold outside. Hi. Oh, hi. Are you the cutest? This is how you wake up after every nap and after every night. Yeah? I love it. It is so sweet and cute. Yeah, we get up. Hi, happy. You're happy. I love it. Yeah, let's get up in it. Oh. Okay. Turn this off. You can turn your fan off. And hello. Do you want to say hello? Say hi, camera. Where's camera? beautiful you are so cute so cute okay <sighs> gotta turn this guy off perfect God. who is texting your mama bubbies
Okay. I'm play on the ground for a little bit. I don't want to play on my bed. It makes me nervous. Here's some toys. Here you go. Here you go. Okay, I just have to answer this text message real quick. Sorry, babies. Squad leader texted all of us in a group chat um, about PT on Monday, just asking for our names and emails and more information on what to wear, what to bring with. So, had to email or text him back quick about that. And Missy is just exploring. Got all fun things. We got her little truck and her trailer down there. That guy. That guy. The baby. Baby. Baby, what you doing? Can we dance? Can you show them how you dance? Go boo 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 you need to show your dance. Missy, Missy. She does. Oh, look at those chunky legs. I'm gonna get the cords. You don't need to get the cords. There's always things covering this outlet here and that one there for the longest time. So it wasn't a problem because there's no way for her to get to them. And she didn't really come in here that often either because it was always such a mess. And it just was not ba very baby friendly. And now it's better. It's still not great, but it's better. What are we doing? I 
glasses and babies are not a good combination whatsoever. I don't know how people have children that have glasses and keep them on because I can't even keep mine on because I have a baby. Okay, you need to let go of this cord. I don't need that broken. I've already broken like 